Hello everybody. Uh, I wanted to do a video today. Um, just a quick video on the another flashlight. And it's another zebra light flashlight I got recently. It is the S6330. Uh, this is a 3XML flashlight. Uh, from what I understand, it uses U3 bend XML emitters. Three of them. And it uses three 18650 batteries. One interesting thing I noticed was that the uh, in the pictures, this uh, didn't necessarily look like a sticker, which is what it is. Uh, some sort of sticker covering up obviously some probably some wires that go down these tubes here and you can see the contact points up in here that's the positive and it's almost uh, like part of a spring One interesting thing I noticed on this particular one is there's, you can see around this spring there's some sort of a, I don't know, epoxy or something. But uh, it's machined very well. There's no flaws of any kind that I can see. All of the emitters are centered nicely. Uses the same button as on the SC600. Now we'll put the batteries back in here. And uh, the light will work with the uh, with this with the cover off. There are three, like the uh, SC-52, there are three uh, different low modes that you can pick. The lowest of which is incredibly low. And that's it right there. So those are the three selectable lows. And then there's a... Uh, medium is the there's two selectable mediums and then a fixed a third fixed medium and then uh, high is incredibly bright as you can see so you can see this is really just uh, a cover for the for the batteries and that's all. A tight fit, one big o-ring on the up by the head there. Again it's all very nicely uh, machined. We've got a night core lanyard on there. It does come with a ring on this lanyard hole but uh, I took it out. Anyway, if we compare the size to the SC600, just about the same height. Obviously, much bigger around. If we uh, put the, this is the SC600 on high. And there's the S6330 on high. You can see bigger hot spot. And uh, definitely much brighter. Surprisingly round. You can see it's just ever so slightly kind of triangular. But really clean beam. 
Um, as always, all of the uh, reflectors are orange peel textured. This will fit uh, mag light sized um, accessories on the front and it's temperature regulated so if you put it on high depending on the temperature it will uh, step down the brightness incrementally um, so that uh, it doesn't damage the LED or anything. This is it compared to the SC52 so you can see it's really a, a small light uh, for the rated 2400 lumens. So, uh, in my opinion, another really nice light from Zebra Light. Uh, pretty, uh, definitely the most powerful flashlight I've got. I got a great deal on it from a guy uh, called Cell Guy on CPF forums. So again, anyone out there looking for a good flashlight, I, I can uh, highly recommend the Zebra Light lights. I think they're, I think they're excellent. So, again, and thanks everyone for watching, um, and we'll see you on the next video.